Hello dinosaur enthusiasts, and welcome back to Jurassic World Evolution 2. Since the last episode, I've gone ahead and done a little bit of work here. I've gone ahead and put in two pens over here, and I've made the uh, track for the ride go through these pens. So that way, I'm not spending a ton of time waiting for stuff to get done here. Guests are complaining about lack of amenities. Place amenities where there are a lot of guests. Alright, what amenities are they lacking? Room coverage is good. Amenities. All right, they seem happy overall with stuff, so I think that's just not true. They're fine with guest amenities. But anyways, right now I'm incubating a dinosaur that we're going to probably put in here. I believe it's sort of a baryonic-style dinosaur that will eat fish. So we're going to get that ready to go and put it in. I've also gotten a few extra scientists in because... I needed them to do some of the research that I'm doing, and I just wanted to make sure that I had everything I needed. Uh, money right now is still a little bit of a problem, so I'm not wanting to spend money on things unless I absolutely need them for right now. Until I get this next dinosaur in, which should check off these two things. We're very close to a three-star rating. That should get us that three-star, and it will increase the species as we need. Curious to see here if people stop for the cars or if the cars just run over people. people do stop. Sort of. Almost. I guess it's good enough. Oh, let's see here. have improved our facilities some. Really, I'm just wanting wider paths now is what I'm wanting. Doesn't look like I can get that. Not seeing it off the top there. So I'm just gonna wait as I said. Financially, I'm hurting a little bit for money. These dinosaurs are costing a decent amount to put out. All right, we have this one ready though, and he will hopefully help us out quite a bit. All right. That was not the one I wanted. Let's go ahead and add a task of checking those two locations there. Here is our new dinosaur. Long floppy neck there it looks like. But we do have the dinosaurs we need so that's good. We'll make sure that he's happy and healthy and then we should as I said be good for the three stars. Definitely want you checking on this dinosaur as soon as he lands. Delivery complete. All right, he is lonely, which is not great because of the fact that he cost a lot to put in here, and so financially I didn't have money for another one. It looks like I need two more of them, actually. Which is not the greatest thing. Alright, area-wise, he needs more area than he has. Um, those things need to be figured out. But I'm going to need to make more of him, and that's not a great thing. Alright. Let's assign scientists to go ahead and do this because we need this done quickly. We'll go ahead and put those three on it. He's gonna be lonely. We're gonna need more of them as quickly as we can.
Area seems good, water seems good. Need sand and forest and fish. All right, well, those things we can help with. All right, so first things first, let's go in here. Let's go, we need fish. We'll have to get fish for them. That'll take a moment or two. We can do sand. We can do sand all over in this area. Plenty of sand. We can also do forest. We got forest all up in that area. Perfect. That's all going well. Let's go over here and see if I can now research fish. I need more money for it. Alright, so I will get him fish as soon as I can. He is lonely, which means he's going to be a problem for us soon enough here. Let's see if these other needs have been taken care of, though. Need some more forest. Good on the fish. Alright, let's put some more forest in to the sand area, maybe? Does that work? Yeah, that seemed to work for him. So, we'll go ahead and put a little bit more forest right in there. That should take care of his forest needs. So now it's just the fish and the loneliness. And we definitely need to be able to feed him here soon enough. I had just figured he wasn't going to need another mate there or anything. Alright, so we're making a decent profit here. Why are we not at three stars yet? Not quite money-wise. Really need that money to come in, though. Or he gets too agitated. Alright, got the money in. Let's go ahead and research. Get that done. Uh, we need four. So that's easy enough. We'll just have... We'll have her do it. Oh, wait. has to be done like that. And then we are going to need two of these eggs, probably. see the other information about these. How many of these like to be in the same area? Can I find that out? Population 1. See, it looks like I might need two there, but I'm not sure. I can at least get him one more. So, that should be a good thing. Let's see if the database says it here. Does not really say. Alright. Well, we will get the feeder in here as quickly as we can. That'll at least make him happy in that respect.
Yeah, his comfort's going downhill in a hurry. Lonely and the fish are the biggest issues. Alright, well I thought I was being clever by putting him out here and such, and it turns out I was not. So I'm going to have to tranquilize him in a bit here to get him under control probably, because he's going to start throwing a tantrum here soon enough. Can't say I blame him. I just need that research to get done as quickly as possible, and then I really need to be able to get some more of these made. Particularly if I can get one more, I think he'll be at least okay for the time being. Now, let's go ahead and dart him for right now. Actually, no. Let's not dart him yet. Alright, we're going to have to dart him because he's going to attack that fence. Which is why we did put the um, uh, very strong fencing in here. So at least that's a good thing. He's not exactly going to break through it easily. But he is unhappy and that's not a great thing. Let's see, if I get the fish feeder in here. I sort of want to see if he'll go towards it. No, he won't. Alright, he's been tranquilized. The fence is still in good shape. Basically, I just have to wait now. Until I can afford... To put another one in here. It's not exactly the greatest situation of all time, but it is the way it is. Alright, he's still okay. We are making a little bit less in profit now. That's not great. Alright. I did read, I believe, that he is okay with compies. Comps again. Do I have those? Or do I still have to search for those? I think I still have to excavate those. Yes, I do. No, it's not worth risking it. Alright, we're just going to have to pick him up, hope that he goes and eats, because I think him being tranquilized is actually costing me money right now. Got the asset. So hopefully he will go and eat. Commencing. 
Increasing asset transit. And I need 155 to get that egg. Hundred thousand five hundred and fifty-five dollars. Asset has been delivered. All right, he's eating. That'll help out some. All right. Comfort-wise, he's a little bit better, so that's a good thing. Let's select the egg. Let's assign the scientists. And let's get this incubated as quickly as we can. Take two minutes. And hopefully one more will be enough to make him happy. Because if not, then we've got a problem. Alright, he's lonely. But that's not the end of the world. His comfort level hasn't dropped, so that's a good thing. His status will need to be checked again. That's okay. We'll get the other one over here. Should be good then. Hopefully the two of them will be happy together, and that'll be good. Release via airlift. We're going to park you right over here with your buddy. Collection. Vehicle coming to check on him. Where is my vehicle for this area? Wrong vehicle. Ranger Team 1. Let's add a task. I want you to go check on these guys right now. Also, when this one lands, I should get a three-star rating, I would think. I mean, I definitely have some quality dinosaurs in this park at this point. I would spend the money on getting some compies and such, but I need to make sure first that these guys are doing okay. Population is still not enough. So I am going to need another one. That's what I was worried about. Alright, let's make one more. For being antisocial, they sure like to be social. <laughs> Alright, uh, that one, that one, and that one. Go ahead and start it. Money-wise, are we at least doing better? We're making 238000 so that's a good thing. Okay, they were talking. We 
I've got the eggs ready, but it's going to take another 150 or 1,555,000 in order to make the egg. So we're going to have to wait. While I'm waiting, let's get the scientists who need to sleep so that they're sleeping. Rest, rest. I know it's costing me money, but I need all my scientists ready for when I'm ready for them. Okay, he was looking at the fence, now he's going to take a nap. That works fine. You go ahead and nap. Got an itch, took care of that. So you should be good to go here. So their loneliness is not the end of the world. Uh, he is trying to attack that <laughs> truck, but that's all right. All right. Resting was completed. Perfect. So they're all ready to go. I just need one more of these guys to come in. And they're still at 80% comfort. So even though they're unhappy because they're lonely, they're still doing okay. Just a little bit more money, and I'll be good. Then we can put the third one in. Vehicle is under attack. Over in the raptor pen. Well, that's going to happen at points. All right. Select the egg. Assign the scientists. We need that scientist, that scientist, and that scientist in order to do it. Let's get them going there. While they're doing that, no, I don't need that. Don't care about those too much. Don't care about that that much. Mercury into 3.5. All right, so I need to have the rating increased. In order to do that one, don't need those medicines, and I'm not going to do those yet. Right, so I guess we're good there. How much is Compi uh, DNA going to cost us? 570,000 to go get that. We'll get that here shortly. speed it up so that way we'll get the one ready and we'll get the other DNA so that way we're all good Dinosaur is ready for release. Perfect. We'll release him via airlift right over here by his buddy. There, he'll be good. We'll just put him right into the water. Then we'll go here. Expedition map. Get the compi. Alright, so we need five. She can do it by herself. So let's send her.
transportation underway. We'll also get some compies on the go over here, so that'll be a good thing then. Then this area will be fleshed out a bit more, and hopefully these guys will be happy, and my uh, rating will go up as well. Has to be three, and not be four. <laughs> Asset delivered. All right, they're now perfect. Great, they're all happy. The other one's over there. He evidently knows the good news, though. Too, he's good. So they're all happy. Perfect. Alright, the expedition was completed. Let's go view the fossils. We want that one. We want to get rid of these that are going to make us some money as well. You know what? Let's take that one out. Fill it up that way. We can sign a scientist to do this. Uh, Faster extraction will be perfect for it. Let's get that underway. Yep, they're all happy. Part of the excitement of being near the dinosaurs is the dangerous nature of some of them. The allure is instinctual fear. But what we're really looking for is something bigger and better. Do you want a T-Rex? Can I have a T-Rex? Wait, what? Really? We can have a T-Rex? Once you expand the park and create a suitable enclosure. Expanding the size of the park is a brilliant idea, and the T-Rex is the most iconic of the dinosaurs. And now, when people come to Jurassic Park, they can see one for themselves. And fear they might get eaten by one. The illusion of risk, not actual risk, is what we strive to achieve. And we'll have a T-Rex. Yep, sort of figured that was what I was going to need to do, which is why I built this pen over here. I haven't edited the terrain or anything, but we have it there ready when we need it. For now, though, let me get some of these compies on the go here. There we go. Modify the genome. Let's make them live to at least a normal length. I think I modified the genome, or did I click out? No, I clicked out. Alright. Save and exit. There we go. Alright, this one should not take much to do, so let's just go ahead and assign Thomas here. Thomas can take care of that one. Then we're going to need a T-Rex. So let's see. Do we have to do research for it? Yes, we are going to need to do research for it. Five, nine, seventeen... I think I have enough, but I'm going to have to have Thomas done over here first. Oh. Infected food source. Well, that's not good. Don't need that for my dinosaurs. Disinfect. Let's go take care of that. Alright, this is good. Let's select some eggs then. Alright, we'll take all of those. We'll assign a scientist to it. We'll assign Flores here. Start that incubation.
I'm wondering if I don't have enough scientists that are capable of it to do it. I have to train them first. That might be a real thing. Or I might have to get rid of one of the ones I have. Who's sort of crummy here? Well, Flores is good in that respect. Shamoon is good in this respect. Huh. You know what? I mean, right now I have 5, 12, 16, 17. Alright, so it does look like I might have the 18 I need when he's not busy. So we'll check after we get these dinosaurs taken care of. Let's also see how the food goes once we disinfect it. Okay, that didn't take much, but we got it fixed. Research a dart. We'll get that one done real fast. Sure, we'll have her do it. them. Right over there. We're going to put their food closer to the entrance area over, let's say here. Now, it says they're good in the same pen as these guys. Hopefully, they don't get eaten. That's the goal. But I guess we'll see. Asset transportation in progress. Alright, we got this tiny little guy. Let's have him checked on. He can just squeeze right through the fence if he wanted to, which is not great. But, not much I can do about that. Alright, so, with that in mind, let's go over here and let us research a T-Rex. Oh, we need two million dollars. We have the people for it now, we just need more money. Gotcha. Well, that won't be too hard here. Basically, I want to make sure in this episode that the compies are all here, settled in, and doing well. And then I will probably end this episode there. He is hard to see. Alright. So let's look at his stuff here. He needs meat, which he does have in the pen. And he needs a population, which he's getting in the pen.
You know what? If they want a nair meat thing over here too, not the end of my world to put a nair meat thing over in that area. There we go. Got me. Alright. They're chatting amongst themselves. We may need some more of those. How are these guys with the uh, increase in cohabitation here? They seem fine with it. So I'm going to make another batch of these guys. Alright. Uh, you can do it. There we go. Delivery has been completed. Transporting asset. I'm not going to put, I'm not going to hatch more right yet because I do want to go ahead and get the uh, money for the T-Rex. But I will put in another batch here to get them in here as well. They are cute little monsters, aren't they? I mean, they definitely tear your face off if they got the chance. There's no question about it. So, while they're cute and cuddly looking, don't put your face too close. Alright, there we go with the two million, so we can get a T-Rex. Oh, that's a problem. Yeah, that does not work. Alright, so... Let's see here. I have four slots available, and it it's really this one here that I'm going to need higher. So I'm going to have to get rid of some of the ones that are not as good in that category. All right. You know what? Let's go ahead and fire. Then let's see who we can recruit. Is it the genetics category that's the one that matters? the best here so we're gonna get her this is why I not a huge fan of this I, I understand they wanted to add some challenge to it but at the same time also I'm not much for the math on this, so. All right, they will work for it. No, they will not. Can I teach one of them? All right, I can train somebody here. So let's train her in genetics. We'll confirm that. All right, now I just need more money to come in because that cost me some money. Delivery complete. Transporting asset. Where are the little ankle biters at?
How are these guys doing with all these little guys in here? They seem fine with it. They don't have a problem at all. Asset transported. All right. Whoop. Somebody got a disease. Let's go ahead and add a task. We'll medicate that guy. Alright, they're happy. They're all hopping around here. Guess that's okay. Alright, so now we should have the scientists we need. And even with my poor math skills. So hopefully we will be able to get this research done. Alright. Go ahead and put in for the T-Rex research. That one, that one, that one, and that one should make 18, yes. Start the task, spend all of our money. We don't even have the capabilities left to deal with that. Alright. How about we train this scientist? Yeah, let's train him up a little bit. There we go. Not research fossils. Let's get through these two fossils. It won't allow me to assign the two scientists that I have who would be capable of it. So I guess we'll just have to wait. But alright, with that being said, I think that we've done a decent amount this particular episode. So I'm going to go ahead and end this episode here. If you enjoyed the episode, go ahead and click that like button. If you've not already, please subscribe to the channel. Click the bell icon so you're aware when I produce new videos in the future. Thank you. Hope to see you all again for the next episode of Jurassic World Evolution 2. Yeah. <laughs>